Hello, internet fans. It's your old pal Rotten Roger DeMarco here from 3bproductionco.com. And yeah, it's Monday again. So by now, you know what that means. That's right. It's time for another Rotten Roger Recommends video. Let me know what you think about the neat little backdrop. We're working on some stuff, making things neat for you out there on YouTube land. Anyway, on to my recommendation for this Monday to make your day a little bit better. So today, my recommendation is Lucio Fulci's 1979 film, Zombie, or Zombie 2, or Zombie Flesh Eaters. Whatever fucking version of this you find, watch it. Okay, so here is your plot breakdown. You've got Tisa Farrow and Ian McCullough, and they are both searching for answers. Tisa Farrow is looking for her father, who is a doctor at this island of Matul. So they go looking for him because he's not answering letters and things like that. And what they find is the fucking zombie apocalypse. It's awesome. And here's a few reasons why it's super rad. Tons of nudity, tons of gore, a fucking shark battling a zombie. Yeah, that happens in the movie. So those things should pique your interest and should sell you. This is a wild Italian zombie horror movie that's sort of an unofficial sequel to George Romero's Dawn of the Dead. It's very Romero-esque, but Italian. So it's sleazy with bush and tits and all the gore you could shake a stick at. And probably one of the most notorious gore scenes ever filmed where a woman gets her eyeball impaled by a piece of a door. And even if you haven't seen this movie, you have seen that scene. You've seen that scene. It's excellent. This is a gnarly ass movie, guys. So if I have swayed you, click the link in the description and get a copy of Lucio Fulci's Zombie today. But uh, I suppose I should probably get going because after all, there's a lot of movies out there. And somebody's got to watch them. So why not me, right? I have all the freedom in the world. I can just leave. See you guys next week. <laughs> you still see me? Yeah. Damn it.